In this video, I am going to show you how to use the mmalt function in Google Sheets. The mmalt function, or the matrix multiplication function, is used to multiply two matrices together. And so what I'm going to do is use this function. I have these two different matrices, matrix 1 and matrix 2, and I'm going to use this function to multiply them together. So the syntax of this function is pretty simple. It is just the function m mult and then matrix 1 and matrix 2. So these have to be an array or a range that contains your matrix. And there is one note that you should know about using this function. The number of columns in matrix 1 has to equal the number of rows in matrix 2. And so we'll go to my example. So the number of columns in matrix one has to equal the number of rows in matrix two. Otherwise, this function is not going to work properly. So what I'm going to do is use this function and I'm gonna create matrix three. And for matrix three, I'm gonna use this function the long way just to show you how the function is working. After that, we will use the short way for matrix four, but these are going to contain the same values. I just want to show you how the function works with this first example. So what you're going to do is select the first cell in your new matrix where you're doing your multiplication and we're going to do the function here. So equals m mult. I'm going to press tab on my keyboard. So the first range that you're going to enter contains your first row in matrix one. And then I'll press a comma and what we're doing is we're multiplying it by my first column in matrix two or my first two rows essentially. press enter on my keyboard. So the value here is 21. So we're multiplying this first row by this first column. So why does this equal 21? Well, what this is doing is five times one. So five times one, and then it's two times eight equals two times eight. And then when you add these together, You can see this is 21. Now I will do the formula in the next cell and what I'm going to be doing this time is taking this second row here Oops. and multiplying it by this second column. And this is 47. So why does this equal 47? Well, three times five is 15. And then we have four times eight is 32. And you can see we get 47. Now we're going to repeat this process for the rest of the matrix. So this time I'm doing the first row and now we're moving on to the second column. And now we're doing the second row by the second column. And then I'm going to again repeat that. And now I have this last column of the matrix. So first row of matrix one by the third column of matrix two. And then second row of matrix one by the third column of matrix two. 
So that is the long way, but I wanted to show you this so that you can understand how this matrix multiplication is working. What you can do though, is actually just do one formula that contains your entire matrix range. So I'm gonna put in that full range of matrix one, the full range of matrix two, and you can see it is exactly equal to the values in matrix three, but that is how you would actually want to do it. It's going to be much more efficient to do it all in one formula. However, it's useful for you to learn just to see how it's getting the number here, doing it step by step. So that is how the matrix multiplication function works, the MM, the M mult function in Google Sheets. That's it for this video. If you have any questions, just let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching the video. If you haven't already, make sure to hit the subscribe button. If you have any questions or content suggestions, just let me know in the comments and I'll try my best to answer everyone.